Carter wanted to take the three ball, but juggled it. Got it to the corner instead, and out of the corner, a three ball thrown in by Madison Seymour, who is second. The Chargers, and they have to be able to handle the ball out front. Now wide open is a three ball thrown in by Madison Seymour. Tend to shoot. Kelly open, thought about it. Now drives the baseline, able to shovel it off, and a little floater thrown in by Megan Hill. Now White gets into a double team. Loose on the floor, stolen away by Hill. Kelsey Shaw the other way. Drops it off inside for Carter for two. Warmack really knows how to get position. She really gets the low block, and that's the place you don't want her to get, but she got there. Now back down inside, a great interior passing from Gabby Reuter to Kayla Raymond for her first points of the day. Surprised at that. Now Seymour, straight away Jen Warden will try a three ball and rattles it home. Now down inside, inside out. Three ball, knocked down by Kayla Raymond. Now Reuter to the wing and a three ball thrown in by Jennifer Warden. Now Bianca Chambers on the drive. Oh, what a block from behind by Jen Warden. Warden the other way. Inside, and there's two for Gabby Reuter. Carter, watched by Pergola. Straight away three ball, knocked down by Taylor Raymond, who goes to double figures with 10 points. And we got about three minutes to go in the third quarter. To the corner, here's Kelly's three ball, knocks it down. Mia Kelly, the 5'6 freshman. Now spinning through, that's a nice move, but a wooden fall. Halfway down and out for Cameron DeBose. Kelsey Shaw the other way. Straight away Raymond. Bang. Crawl back into this one. Won't be easy. Down 22. Two, three zones. Guyark's going to get some open looks. They get it down inside for Raymond, who scores. Glidden in the corner. Trying to spin out of trouble, Semenak. To the wing and a three ball thrown in by Aaron Donlin. How about a Stonehill team that holds New Haven to 45 points? Final score, game one of our doubleheader. Stonehill 63, New Haven 45. So how are you feeling, Jen? Pretty good, yeah. Now, according to the numbers that I had coming into this game, you had played a total of 21 minutes. I think you played more than that today. <laughs> yeah. So, obviously, the team has been very careful with you health-wise. You're obviously feeling better. Even the last few games, you haven't played that many minutes. Was that a case of you telling the coaches, I'm ready to go? How does that work? What's that? Um, How does that plan that you can all of a sudden play as many minutes as you did today? Um, it just starts in practice. Like, she bases it off who's working hard, rebounding, and um, I just knew we ha I needed to work hard to get on the court. And do some damage. A lot of stamina for, for not <laughs> playing that much. I yeah. think you really were able to, I'm not sure how many minutes you played. It must have been around 25 minutes. Yeah. Tell me about this team now that is really playing well. 4-0 in January. You guys have played some of the best teams in the country. I'm not sure if you're even aware of it, but you played the second toughest schedule in Division II in the country this year. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah, that is, <laughs> it, that is a fact. That's right in our notes right here. <laughs> And you guys are having a great season. Yeah. What's the what's what what's making the difference so far this season? Um, difference is rebounding, um, getting in practice, getting reps, and then knowing the team that we're playing next, and just playing to their tendencies and working on our game. My buddy, Mr. Buckley, says it's a different team when you're on the floor. <laughs> Why? Um, I just look for the open person and. Um, Trying to get as many assists as I can. Well, congratulations. That was great. It was fun Thank to watch today. Nice to have you back. Thank you. Thanks, Jen. Jen Warden for the Skyhawks, who was outstanding in the win. You know, I'll start by talking about uh, Kara Kelly and Shelby Buck, our assistant coaches, and how they're getting us prepared and, and just the scouts and, and coming up with a great defensive game plan. And, you know, obviously we, we threw some – zone at them today, um, which I don't think that they were prepared for as much zone as we played. And the kids were just, they, they're doing their jobs and they're understanding we did a better job rebounding today, still got to work on it, but it was better than the other night and that made a difference as well. Jenny played really well against them last year down there. I think she's a, she likes to play UNH. <laughs> 
but great to have them both back and into the flow and you know getting their legs under them obviously Kayla is playing with that bounce again and um, she had she had a great day a uh, good scoring day and Jenny you know with Emily being out today Jenny did a great job stepping into the point guard role having you know been playing very limited minutes um, she gave us great minutes today and you know she she did what she does she's such a great competitor you know she's She's just not afraid when she plays, and, and it really, obviously, it made a difference today. You know, Maddie's just bringing a good consistency, you know, understanding, you know, her shot selection, you know, started really strong, hit, hit a couple big threes for us, and, and that's what she's been doing, you know. She's been doing a great job. And I think you have to talk about Kelsey Shar and Gabby Ruder. They're, they're two seniors who they are bringing such a great consistency to what we're doing and you know Kelsey has played the one through the four for us this year and defensively she's matching up with their toughest opponents on the perimeter and she's just so tough you know her toughness makes such a difference and you know she was getting beat up today and just kept coming back and getting on the floor so I can't say enough about her or Gabby you know Gabby's D in the middle against the big um, you know, 21 is such a talented player, and, and Gabby certainly had a challenge today, but, you know, rose to that challenge defensively and rebounding-wise. You know, they're both just playing with such senior urgency. It's, it's awesome. Yeah, this is, you know, this is what it is, though. It's, you know, we talk about it a lot in terms of, you know, this is why our league is so good. You, you have to be ready every night. You can't rest, you know. you got to prepare well because everyone is well coached and playing well. So, you know, it'll be nice to be home, though, for sure.